Hello, good day everyone. In today's tutorial, I want to prove that the sum of the interior opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral are supplementary. When we say angles are supplementary, we mean their sum equals 180 degrees. So this is a cyclic quadrilateral. It is enclosed in a cycle. We want to show that angle A, which is this, plus angle C, which is opposite to the angle A, is the same thing as angle B, which is this, plus angle D, which is equal to 180 degrees. This condition only holds if the vertices of this quadrilateral all lies on the part of the cycle. So there are a couple of ways for you to prove this, but I think the best way is to draw diagonal lines in this quadrilateral. So let me do that. So before I start, I want to remind us about something. In cycle theorem, all angles formed from the same arc to any part of the circumference are the same. They are exactly the same. So let us consider this arc BC. It forms an angle here and it forms another one here. So we can call them A and E because they are the same. Moving to other arc CB, it forms an angle here and here again, so we can call them B and B. This is arc AD, it forms angle here, so we can call this C. It also forms another angle here, which is also C, because they are the same. Moving on to the last arc, it forms an angle here, which we can call D. It forms another angle here, which is also D. Having done this, remember, we should know that the sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral is equal to 360 degrees. So if we add angle A, B, C, D, we are going to obtain 360 degrees. Therefore, we say A plus B plus C plus D equals 360 degrees. But angle A, you can see, is A plus B, so we can replace it with A plus B plus angle B is C plus B, C plus B plus C. We have it as D plus C, C plus D. Plus angle D, we have it as A plus D, A plus D. The, the whole of this will be 360 degrees. But if you look at them, each one of them appears twice. We have A here, we have A here, B here, B here, C here, and D. So we can see 2A plus 2B plus 2C plus 2D, the whole of this equal to 360 degrees. Because they have two in common, we can factor the two out. So we have two outside, A plus B plus C plus D inside, and the whole of this equal to 360 degrees. We can divide both sides by two. Two divided by two is one, and 360 degrees divided by two is 180 degrees. Therefore, we have A plus B plus C plus D equals 180 degrees. All right, let us start with A plus C. Angle A plus angle C, they say is 180 degrees. Angle A, we can see it as A plus B. So we have A plus B, plus angle C is C plus D, we have C plus D. The whole of this is 180 degrees, and hence you can see they are exactly opposite to one another. So we have proven this. For the other one, B plus D is equal to 180 degrees. Angle B, 
is C plus B. So we have C plus B plus angle D is A plus D. A plus D equals 180 degrees. C plus B, you can see it here. And the other one, A plus D, they are exactly opposite to one another. And the result is 180 degrees and hence proved. And this is all I have for you today. Thank you for watching and do have a nice day.